What's up, my beautiful people? This is Galactic Goddess Tarot, and today we will be doing 18 years or older messages from your person for the sign of Libra. So, if you're not already subscribed, please subscribe, come join our family, and if you like, give this video a thumbs up. I definitely appreciate it, and it definitely helps out the channel a whole lot. Just remember that I am reading for a collective, so this video may or may not resonate with you. If this video does not resonate with you, feel free to watch your moon and your rising sign. And also just keep in mind that not every single card may be your message and that's okay as well. So if the card doesn't apply, we just let that shit fly. All right, let's get right into the video for our Libra and Libra cross watchers. I do have a white candle lit for us. And also just another reminder, this is a video for 18 years or older, okay? This is for my grown folks. So if you're not 18 years or older, this is your time to exit the video now. I do have tons of other videos you guys can go watch. This one right here is just for my grown peoples, okay? All right, my Libras, let's get right into it. I will go ahead and split the deck. Ooh, Libra. We got, let's get nasty. Mm. Libra, Libra, Libra. Whoever this person is, they're trying to get nasty with you, okay? Maybe you and this person had some, some wild times together. Maybe they want to have some wild times with you. You know, if that floats your boat, that's what you're into. Let your freak flag fly. <laughs> but yeah, your person, they think about getting nasty with you. They think about getting down. Let's see what else we get. Ooh, we have a blockages. So Libra, you're definitely dealing with somebody who has, either there could be blockages within this connection or this person could individually have uh, some blockages. Um, Libra, I don't necessarily, I'm not getting the vibe that it's coming from like your end. I'm definitely getting more of a vibe that it's coming from their side. This person could have some blockages. Um, everybody's situation is gonna be a little different because this is a collective reading. Um, but yeah, you are dealing with someone who has um, some blockages going on, okay? Um, this person may need to like work on these blockages in order to move forward, in order to actually like have a successful connection with you. They may have to handle these blockages first, especially depending on whatever the blockages could be. Um, let's see what else we get, Libra. Spirit, please give me messages for Libra's person. And I do apologize if my voice sounds a little funny. I'm still coming, I'm still getting over um, the little flu bug I had and I'm still a little congested from that, you guys. So I apologize. All right, Libra. We have, I miss you. Mm -hmm. Libra, your person is missing you right now. They are reminiscing about you. They're thinking about you or on their mind. I feel like this person, is thinking, sitting around thinking about the times you guys shared together. Whether, depending on your situation, whether you have actually like been connected to this person intimately, or maybe you guys were working towards that. This person is missing you. They're missing your energy. They're missing your conversations. They're missing talking to you. Um, they're missing your guys' connection. I feel like this person um, does genuinely miss you. They do genuinely miss you guys um, being connected with one another. Ooh. I'm not going to give up easy. Ooh, Libra. So your person, they're not just gonna walk away from this. Even if even if you turn this person down, you're like, nope, I'm not having it. This person's not having it, Libra, okay? They are not gonna play with you today. They are not. <laughs> they are coming and they mean business. Look, they are not going to just walk away from this easily. This person feels very connected to you. This person definitely feels a deep connection with you. And they're not, they're, they're not just going to give up. Maybe they'll fall back for a little while or give you some space, but they're not just going to give up, Libra. You're not going to shake this one that easy, okay? <laughs> we have, I'm very drawn to you. So your person is very drawn to you. Like I said um, just before that, see, I can't make this up. This person does feel very connected to you. They do feel a special like bond with you. Um, Maybe you are very uh, connected to this person. Maybe you guys are spiritual or maybe um, you're spiritual and you've like opened this person's eyes to spirituality, whatever the case may be. Um, 
this person does feel very drawn to you, like almost like a magnetic pull towards you. This is why this person can't stop thinking about you. Maybe you and this person have shared some like, you know, some, um, what's the word to say? Maybe you guys have shared some, I'm just going to, you know, nasty moments. And I don't mean nasty as like literally nasty, but you guys get what I'm saying. Freaky moments. Maybe you guys let y'all freak flags fly together or something like this person does feel very connected to you in a way. Um, and it is a very strong sexual connection between you two. I do feel like this person is definitely reminiscing on your guys' sexual connection with one another, okay? We have a past lover. See, this is definitely somebody from your past. This is somebody you have been connected to. This is somebody you have history with, okay? This is a past lover reminiscing about you guys. And it's crazy that I use the word reminiscing. Um, when I started out the reading, I, I think I started out saying this person was reminiscing about you. So it goes to show you that that energy is strong. This past lover is like shook by you. Okay. <laughs> Can we do it again? <laughs> Libra, this person wants to do it again. Okay. This person wants to relive that um, magical moment you guys had. <laughs> Um, whatever, you know, whatever moment you guys had where y'all were letting y'all freak flags fly, Libra, this person wants to do it again. They want another round, okay? <laughs> justice. So some of you guys do deserve justice in this situation. Maybe justice was not served in this situation um, just yet, okay? Spirit is working on that. Um Maybe you deserve justice in this situation. Maybe something happened in this connection where justice needs to be served. Um, maybe these blockages, you know, aren't necessarily, mm, what's the word? How do I want to say it? Maybe these blockages that this person has um, that kind of block this connection, maybe, you know, maybe it affected you in a certain way. Maybe, um Maybe the blockages is, it could simply just be, maybe this person doesn't know how to be faithful. Maybe they don't know how to love people correctly, you know, or have healthy relationships. Uh, maybe this person did you wrong. Maybe this person did you dirty or something. Um, like I said, everybody's situation is going to be a little different. But spirit is coming to bring you justice, Libra. Spirit is not coming to play. And you deserve some justice in this situation. And you're going to receive that, okay? We have sneaky link Ooh. so for some of you guys maybe this person was your sneaky link okay maybe you were this person's sneaky link maybe um you know maybe you guys had some some little sneaky link situations going on it could be maybe this person is known for having sneaky links maybe that's what the blockage was in this connection maybe this person didn't know how to just be with one person um, I'm not gonna say they didn't know how, but maybe this person just isn't like a one person type of person. Um, maybe they're known to have sneaky links. All right. You're the best I've ever had. Libra, this is why this person can't shake you. This is why they're not just gonna give up easily. You didn't put it down on this person and they're not just gonna walk away from that. Okay, they want some more. They wanna do it again, Libra. See, that's your fault. You can't be, look, you can't be just getting nasty, putting it down on people, okay? <laughs> Libra, look, letting your freak flag fly with this person. Now I got this person hooked. And then we do have blindfolds. See, some of y'all was letting that freak flag fly. Some of y'all was, look, mm, 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 mm. having a good old time. <laughs> this person, maybe you used the blindfold with this person. Maybe this person has brought it up to you about being blindfolded or blindfolding you or this person could just want to blindfold you point blank period they want to do it again but this time they want to bring a blindfold this time they're trying to put the blindfold on okay this person said they like surprises <laughs> i see you in my dreams Libra, this person is dreaming about you. They're having dreams about you. This person could be receiving messages from spirit as well regarding this connection. This could be why this person is reminiscing about you so much. It could be that they're literally having dreams about you. They're seeing you in their dreams. So now they can't shake. They can't shake you out of their head in a sense. Like they don't know how to get you out of their head. 
Now they're missing you. They're missing your energy. They're missing your presence. They're missing your voice. You know, they're missing your touch. And it's because it's because of these dreams. I feel like this person is literally dreaming about it. Okay. And mm, even dreaming about it. If you get what I'm saying. Wink, wink. <laughs> we have, I want you in my bed. Ooh. Libra, this person wants you in their bed and they want to get nasty in the bed with you. They want you back in their bed. They said that their bed is home. Okay, they want you to come back home, Libra. And for some of you that literally, they, that's literally what this person's saying. They want you to come back home. So maybe you used to live with this person. Maybe you stayed with this person for a while. Um, or maybe this person stayed with you or something. But I do have a sense of, you know, like come back home. You know, maybe it could be for some of you guys, maybe it could mean like come back to me like the person is home or maybe you feel like home to this person. But I'm definitely going to message something about home. OK, so that may resonate with somebody who is watching. It's not going to resonate for everybody. When I'm with other people, I think of you. Libra, like I said, this person can't shake you out of their mind when they're with other people, even when they're like connected to other people and stuff like that. You're the person on their mind. Even if this person has like tried to go out and date other people and, you know, have a couple like rendezvous with some people and stuff like that. This person is thinking about you when they're with these people. This person can't get you out of their head. Even if this person is slept in the bed next to somebody, they're having dreams about you. This person just can't, they can't like escape your energy. They can't escape the thought of you, Libra. And it's making this person like want you even more. <laughs> Ooh, Libra, I love when you ride it. Ooh, so for some of you guys, you didn't got on top, you didn't rode it, and now this person they want seconds, okay? Or maybe this person rode you. Maybe they love when they're on top of you and you, and they ride it. You know? Ooh, this person look. Somebody been riding and somebody been doing a damn good job, okay? <laughs> Oh, Libra, y'all, y'all reading got me all hot. And see, normally I have a glass of wine with me, and today I didn't get a glass of wine, but I should have got one. <laughs> we have, you hit the spot. Ooh, mm, 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 mm. I feel like this card is saying, like, you hit the spot, like, in a sense of, okay, not like that, you nasties. I ain't say I ain't mean it like that. Okay, <laughs> get your mind out the gutter. No, I'm just playing. <laughs> but no, you hit the spot. Like you just hit like a certain spot in this person's heart. Like I think this person almost has like a soft spot for you in a sense. Like this person, yeah. Like they have a they have a soft spot for you because you just you just hit that spot in their heart. Like I, I hope you guys understand what I'm saying. Like this person. Yeah, it's just a soft spot for you. This person has a soft spot for you and you just hit that spot for them. I feel like maybe this person has isn't like the typical person to have like soft spots for people and stuff like that. Um, but they got one for you, Libra. They got one for you. And we have signs. I did say that I did say that this person could be receiving messages from spirit in their dreams. And this is confirmation that this person is receiving signs. So maybe you could be dealing with like a soulmate, twin flame, um, you know, divine connection type of situation. But I do feel like this person is receiving signs when it comes to you. This person could be realizing like who you are to them on a spiritual level, on an energetic level. Um, and this person is starting to pick up on these signs. They're starting to realize like, hey, maybe these dreams mean something. Maybe all these angel numbers I'm seeing mean something. So maybe some of you guys are also catching a lot of angel numbers. Just know your person is also catching a lot of angel numbers. We have damaged femme. So somebody has some damaged feminine energy to them. And just remember that we all have masculine and feminine energy within us. So, um, you know, it can go either way. So maybe, you know, your person could be dealing with some damaged feminine energy or it could be you. Somebody needs to work on their feminine energy, okay? Somebody needs to tap into that side of them and heal that. You know, sometimes we all go through things. We have life experiences. And we don't realize how much it really does affect us, whether it's our masculine or feminine energy. So somebody has some damaged feminine energy that they need to tend to. Let's see what else we get. 
Spirit, please send me messages. Oh, there we go. All right. We have look me in my eyes. So maybe you have like really beautiful eyes, okay? Maybe your eyes are just like very like dreamy, very sexy. This person wants you to look them in their eyes. This person wants to make eye contact with you. They want to just stare deep into your eyes and you stare deep into their eyes. You know that powerful connecting feeling when you're looking into somebody's eyes? This person wants to have that moment with you. This person is daydreaming about that. They're daydreaming about looking into your eyes. I feel like somebody who's watching this is known for their very beautiful eyes. Maybe you have like a very particular eye color or something like that, but it's something about your eyes to this person. Ooh, and we have BDSM. So for some of you guys, maybe your person's into BDSM or maybe you are. Maybe you guys have talked about, you know, dabbling into that with each other, you know? Maybe you guys have had those type of conversations and you know, you know, maybe one of you guys are into that. Maybe you both are into that. Maybe that's what you guys were doing when y'all were getting nasty, letting your freak flag fly, you know? More power to you, hey? But regardless, that's gonna ring, you know, that's gonna be a confirmation for somebody watching. We have a throw it back. Ooh, you know, maybe some of y'all, some of y'all got like a real nice booty. Um, and this person, they want you to throw it back and they want to catch it. Okay. Maybe that's, maybe that's like, um, a position you guys did a lot. Maybe that's a position you guys liked. Um, you know, maybe that's something that you guys just were really into in this connection, you know, throwing it back and that's where it was the best at, you know? But this person, they're reminiscing about that and they're trying to have you throw it back again, okay? Either they're trying to have you throw it back or they want to throw it back on you. A few more cards. Spirit, please give me messages from Libra's person. Spirit, please give me messages from Libra's person. Spirit, please give me messages from Libra. Ooh, there we go. All right, last couple cards. Ooh, we have a squirt. Mm. So maybe some of you guys are a squirter. Maybe uh, this person's a squirter. But this person, they're thinking about it. Maybe you made this person squirt. Maybe they made you squirt and go crazy. Mm. We have a dinner date. So some of you guys may actually get asked out to go on a dinner date. Maybe recently this person asked, asked you on a dinner date. Maybe last time you seen this person, you went on a dinner date. Um, but I do have a feeling that maybe this person is going to reach out to you and ask you to go on a dinner date with them. I feel like this person may actually like want to sit down and talk to you and like use that dinner date to look in your eyes. Uh, duh. Just, just saying, you know. <laughs> last card. We have a sexual healing. Yeah, we got some damaged feminine energy here. This person could use some sexual healing. I feel like this person wants some sexual healing with you. Maybe you guys could use some sexual healing. This person feels like they could get some serious sexual healing from you. Um, and not in a like, I'm just taking from you type of sense. But like in a very like romantic, like, you know, you guys have... You guys have sexual healing in the connection together, you know? You guys have a sexual healing moment together in this connection. I feel like that's what this person wants with you. This person wants to go on a dinner date with you and have some sexual healing afterwards, okay? Have that moment where you guys come back together and just love on each other, period. But all right, Libra, that's all I have for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it resonated for you guys. Um, if it did and you're not already subscribed, please subscribe and join our family. And also, if you haven't already, please give this video a thumbs up. I really do appreciate it, you guys. And it really does help out the channel a whole lot. I love you guys so much. And I hope you guys have a beautiful, beautiful day. And I will see you guys later. Bye.